What's up dudes, it's your bestest buddy in the whole frickin' galaxy, Urban Blaster, and we're playing some Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes. It's that free-to-play mobile game because I don't pay for this shit. And I uh, just want to welcome you to another video. There's been a lot of changes in the past few weeks. We got Mods 2.0, we got a lot of uh, my favorite changes, a lot of, uh, you know, s uh, stuff around scoundrels and bounty hunters. Those are my two favorite uh, what are they, classes, whatever, in this game. And in this video, we're going to take a look at that, uh, the Galactic Bounties, uh, part two that came out, the second event. It is a special, uh, er, it's a rare event. You know, you can get a hundred thousand, uh, dineros, or you can get fifty of the purple things, and then you can get shards of your favorite tunes. And of course the hardest, most sought after ones are Emphis Nest, and we're going to see if we can get that, uh, those shards. This event did come out on August uh, 24th of the t 2018. I know it's been about a week, a little over a week, but I am, uh, I did record those, uh, those uh, battles and we're gonna evaluate those now see what happened see what teams I used but let's uh, let's uh, get to that okay dude so here we are it is my wicked set of bounty hunters as you can see I got a lot of gold out there going on the next one to be golded will be Bosk, Ambo and R Singh those two are the two latest new characters they are uh, Ambo is gear 11 and Aura Singh is uh, not trailing too far from that. But in this upcoming video or battle, we did take on the Emphis Nest. Gear 11 or higher, it is the hardest uh, bounty to try to get for those infinite Emphis Nest shards in the Bounty Hunters Galactic Bounty number 2. But uh, we did go with an Embo uh, led team. Let's see what his uh, leadership. Like I was saying, we did go with an Embo led team. Let's see what his uh, leadership ability brings. All bounty hunters gain plus 50% counter chance and a plus 50% health still. Boom! He brings a he turns your bounty hunters into a counter team. And when a bounty hunter ally scores a hit during their turn, they gain offense up. So they will be hitting harder. He does have a contract. You just go after any enemies with no green above their head. You hit them 15 times. Boom! You uh get your payouts and the rewards are all bounty hunter allies gain a plus 50% offense whenever a bounty hunter ally uses a basic ability they deal uh, bonus damage equal to 7% of the targets max protectiones boom so he will uh, be bringing in those counter uh, uh, attempts and whatnots bumping up offense and whatnots but let's uh, see this battle and how it went down We interrupt this battle for some uh, breaking news. Ambo has lost his hat out on Tatooine. A big Augusta wind came by. I lost my hat. It's my favorite hat. <laughs>
Frickety frack, we got annihilated. Did you see that? We did make it to the end with the payouts going on. We got that in the first uh, one of four, the first uh, set part of that battle. And then we made it to the end with everybody intact, but Emphis Nest was doing these one hit wonders. Boom, we got annihilated. So we are going to bring in the best uh, uh, bounty hunter lead in the game, Boba Fett. He does uh, bring a lot. Bumps up the team a lot. Allies uh, gain 50% critical damage and 10% critical chance. Bounty Hunter allies gain 15 speed for each uh, debuffed enemy so that you want the red above the head. They gain max health equal to 50% of the total potency of all the Bounty Hunters. So I do have potency mods bumping these dudes up. And they gain a 15% turn meter whenever a thermal detonator explodes when Boba Fett is in the okay that's his payout thing his contract is easy defeat the first enemy that takes a turn boom just kill that fool put him to rest and you get his bounty rewards all bounty hunter allies have plus 25 percent tenacity for the rest of the battle and their payouts are activated okay and that tenacity will help to keep the red off this team's head but let's see how that battle goes went down Guys, it's your bestest buddy in the whole freaking universe. Urban Blaster, playing some uh, Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes. It's not free to play mobile game, cause I don't pay for this shit. And why is Swabba so wizard? You got some fragile press, the proof full to rest. Luminara, I shall force splash you to tomorrow. Guys, it's your bestest buddy in the whole freaking universe. Urban Blaster, playing some uh, Star Wars Galaxy of Heroes. It's not free to play mobile game, cause I don't pay for this shit. And why is Swabba so wizard? You got Surprise your press, the proof for the rest. Luminara, I shall force splash you to tomorrow. Crag on Jane, no double wall, I walk a fool. Land all, he'll make it rain blood on his enemies with no freaking remorse. Then there's the droids, you can never fucking trust a droid. My man, 86, 86. Then there's 88, he's 86, is cool cousin. That's why I was one the same wizard. You got greed, oh, right, you gotta go. Dangar, he'll chin chin wreck a fool. And we got that victory! Boom goes the dynamite. We got that victory. Whew. It was a, na a nail biter. It was, uh, I think it was all R and Jesus was on my side because it was a one hit wonder. I couldn't get uh, my second chance. I couldn't get uh, another set of uh, Amphis Nest shards. So I did take in my counter bounty hunter team against the uh, Holdo. Uh, uh, bounty which is a gear uh, 9 or higher and it was a, a little bit tough but I did uh, get those uh, holdo shards oh shit that's a hashtag spoiler alert but here is that battle
Fuck yeah, dudes, Victor Ray, we crushed it. We got those holdo shards thanks to that counter bounty hunter team led by Embo. I hope you guys did like this video. Sorry I didn't have any commentation going on during the battle. And I'm not so good going back and adding that stuff. But, uh, you know, the, the time was ticking when that uh, event came out. I didn't, I wasn't set up for it, the mic and all that, so I did record the battles. I hope you guys enjoyed them. I am going to be uh, hoping that event comes back around because I need those Enfys Nest Shards. I am going to plan on building up my team a little bit more. Hopefully by then I will have all Bosky Bosk ready. He is only 6 star. He is close to being 6 star. But could I get that 7 star before then? We'll see. But uh, if you guys uh, keep tuning in, I hope you like these videos. And uh, please keep tuning in. I will be doing some more t-shirt giveaways. Keep an eye out for those. But if you can uh, wait for those, just uh, head out to UrbanBlaster.com and pick you up on those shirts. It'll help uh, support this channel. And it gets you a nice uh, memorabilia of this uh, game, this channel, the whatnots. But I hope you guys like this video. Keep tuning in. And I'll see you in the next one.